if somebody has good base in the sense like the teachings of the Four Noble Truths that he or she had really have studied, have read, have learned, have practiced. Then, you know, going through these different traditions, different teachers, different styles, the person will not confused. And then he or she can relatively easily to combine different styles, different teachings, different from the different traditions to apply his or her own spiritual journey. I don't think that. The problem is the person or the individuals have not established foundation like the Four Noble Truths or some other those foundations of the teachings of the Buddha have not established that the foundation then try to go to visit and these different then try to combine you know the different styles and different traditions and different topics this may cause difficulties this may cause difficulties confusions misunderstandings mispractice and that there's a there's that risk so my usual uh, suggestion to the people is really first learn some of those you know, the teachings for the both traditions, Theravadan traditions and the minor traditions, like the Four Noble Truths, like the 37th aspect of the path to enlightenment, you know, the, like the, you know, the four, find, four, uh, uh, four foundation of mindfulness, and so on and so forth. What is, according to the Buddhism, what is ethics? What is, you know, concentration? What is wisdom? If you learn those basic things, then you know having access to many different teachers, many different traditions, and many different styles will be plus. Mm-hmm.